In the heart of Cairo and inside the Egyptian Museum, an honoring ceremony dedicated to the archaeologist Dr. Zaya Hawass was held. Honored tonight really to see that Bragg University is producing the three volumes to honor me tonight. It's, I'm really glad that more than 130 scholars from all over the world wrote uh, articles in my honor. And this Dr. Khaled Anani tonight and uh, the vice president of the Charles University to give me the three volumes. This is an honor for me. Articles written in my honor from 130 scholars from all over the world, more than 30, 30 countries representing, and this is really a good honor for me. The event gathered a large number of officials, archaeologists, Egyptologists, famous writers in addition to actors and actresses. Dr. Khaled Al Anani, Minister of Tourism and Antiquities, also attended the event. The event was attended by ambassadors of Denmark, Mexico, Cuba, in addition to the Egyptian ambassador Mushira Khattab. I feel great and I'm very proud. Uh, I'm very proud of, uh, of this place, like I said. I'm very proud with the work that's ongoing in this area and I'm very proud of Dr. Zahi Hawass, like you said, he's an icon and he never stopped for a minute uh, working with uh, passion, perseverance, vision. He's a great ambassador for Egypt, not only Egypt of today, but Egypt of 7,000 years of uh, civilization. Uh, he's a globetrotter, um, presenting Egypt, its culture, its heritage, its history uh, in a very attractive, appealing uh, manner. He is very, very popular all over the world. And really, Dr. Zai Hawass uh, presents the soft power of Egypt. Dr. Mustafa Waziri, Secretary General of Supreme Council of Antiquities, was one of the speakers at the event. In his word, he described Dr. Zahi Hawass as the godfather, a teacher from which archaeologists have learned a lot. Also, Dr. Mustafa Al-Fi'i, in his word, described how Hawass is faithful to his work. As you know, uh, Zahi Hawass is an international figure. His name is not limited to Egypt or to the Arab world. He is well known everywhere. I hear people talking about him in London, in New York, all over the world. He is the most famous Egyptologist in our time. I consider him not as a very close friend of mine, but because of his efforts and what he has done in the last 30, 40 years, this is his credit in all cases. That's why he is honored by many uh, ranks and many uh, honorary degrees for all what he has done. I take this opportunity tonight while we are celebrating in this distinguished place the old museum of Egypt. I consider this is a message from Egypt itself to one of her sons, Zahi Hawass, the great Egyptologist, the man whose name is known all over the world. And I think we should use that name for giving more attention to the old uh, antiquities and the history of our own country. Dr. Anani handed Dr. Hawass the three volume papers written by Egyptologists from all over the world. For his part, Dr. Hawass gave Dr. Anani as a gift an encyclopedia gathering pictures and text to all our monuments and in which is the considered best publication in archaeology. Amal Mukhtar reporting for Nile TV International, Cairo.